Kit Harrington and his other half Rose Leslie tied the knot back in 2018 after the pair's on-screen romance in HBO's Game of Thrones through Jon Snow and Egret became reality off-camera. With the Golden Globe winning drama now over, both actors have moved on to pastures new, although during a chat with Zoe Ball on her BBC Radio 2 show, Harrington admitted his latest role has thrown up one or two spanners to the pair's life. After their introductions during Thursday's show, Zoe said to the GOT star, Kit Harrington is with us, he is about to star as Henry V in the Donmire Warehouse in London from February 22nd until April 9th. You mentioned when you were talking Kit about your wife, Rose Leslie, who you met on Game of Thrones and it was her birthday this week. Did you spoil her rotten? Zoe asked before Kit deliver some rather disappointing news. He revealed, we're in tech this week, so we're not even. I'm practically not gonna see her. Oh no, Zoe said before a sympathetic Kit explained, yeah I know, we've really failed with each other's birthdays this year. The GOT star did explain, however, but we've got a baby. So it's all about the baby now. The pair shared a laugh before Zoe continued, It's the perfect excuse and this is what tends to happen, kids come first and everyone else tends to take a back seat. The BBC presenter then moved on to discuss Rose's newest role in the star-studded blockbuster, Death on the Nile. You mentioned thought that she was having a dinner probably with the cast of Death on the Nile. I am such a massive Agatha Christie fan, slightly obsessed, we have all waited so long to see this film, she continued. Zoe then asked, Kenneth Bran is directing and starring as Poirot and Rose is in it, does this mean you've seen it? Do you know what? I haven't seen it yet, Kit replied. She hasn't seen it but she's going to see it this weekend, he went before he joked at another problem his packed schedule has posed. Kit continued, and again Zoe, like a bad husband, I'm busy so I can't see it. Laughs. So I'll see it at some point but what a cast, he concluded before Zoe signed off, it's gonna be epic. Rose and Kit welcomed their first child together in early 2021 nearly three years after tying the knot. The pair's rep confirmed the news at the time to E! saying the pair had welcomed a baby and were very, very happy. Since leaving Game of Thrones, Kit has also gone on to star in Netflix's Criminal as well as Amazon's Modern Love. Rose, on the other hand, landed a recurring role in BBC's Vigil and Paramount Plus's The Good Fight. Game of Thrones seasons 1 to 8 are available to stream on now now.